Are you looking for the best all-in-one homeschooling curriculum? A curriculum that will span from grade one all the way to grade 12 so that throughout your homeschooling journey, you would never have to change a thing? Does one exist? Well, stay tuned to find out. So I've had a lot of people ask me in the comments to share more about the Alviary. And yes, I believe the Alviary is this all-in-one curriculum, really the best all-in-one curriculum that does span all the way from grade one to grade 12, leaving absolutely nothing else. And you would never have to supplement anything else for the rest of your homeschooling journey if you did not want to. So let me share with you all the details about the Alviary. So like I said, the Alviary has curriculum from grades one, and they also actually share some pre-learning um, lesson plans and activities for the kindergarten age as well, but their formal lesson plans begin at grade one. But there are things for you to do if you want to start early. So kindergarten all the way to grade 12. And up to grade 12, every subject is covered. They cover every possible subject that you could ever think of and with those subjects, they include lesson plans that are built so that you don't have to do any of the legwork. It is all done for you. So here is a list of all the subjects that the Alviary offers. And I'm going to read it because I obviously, well, I wouldn't be able to memorize it. So there are art lessons, actual physical art lessons where your students will be learning how to do painting and brush drawing artist studies so that you are actually studying famous artists in what they call picture study bible and church history where they will be reading the entire bible over the span of all of the years and studying history alongside the bible citizenship is a subject that not too many people will know about unless you are a charlotte mason homeschool but in citizenship they look at political leaders and great leaders throughout history, beginning in ancient times through a writer called Plutarch. And through that, you get to see what makes a good leader and what makes a bad leader. But it is almost like a government that you might learn in public schools. This is called citizenship. And they read the writings of Plutarch to start with because he covers some of the great ancient leaders and talks about what made them great and what made some not so great. They include language arts, which would be reading, penmanship, and grammar as well later on, writing and composition, as well as something they call recitation, which really would help in public speaking. They teach geography, history, life skills and handicrafts such as sewing, typing, and something that I've talked about in previous videos called paper sloyd literature, and they cover general literature, mythology, poetry, and Shakespeare. They teach Latin. They teach other modern languages such as Spanish and French. They have math. They teach music from lessons in learning how to sing the solfa, as well as to composer studies, hymn studies, and learning folk songs. They include physical education, which no other curriculum I know of includes physical education. They include science, and they also provide other resources to study, such as coding and other types of arts and crafts and things like that. But coding is an excellent one here in Canada because coding has now been included in the public school's math curriculum. So they include that as an extra resource. Uh, they provide resources for that so that your student can learn coding. So they provide lesson plans for every single one of these subjects, and they are excellent. All the legwork is done. There is nothing that you need to supplement to um, follow these lesson plans. And there really isn't a whole lot, if really anything at all, pre-planning ahead. You could just open and go and read along in the lesson plan and do the lesson with your student. I do like to read ahead a little bit just because I can pre-print maps and pictures and things. And then I feel like I'm not wasting time doing that the day of school or during the lesson but it's very simple and easy to print and you know really read about what you'll be teaching that day. It's very straightforward. I've had some teacher's guides and curriculums that really require a lot of prep work and I would say this would be considered open and go. So an alviary year is divided into three 12 week terms for a total of 36 weeks. And what I love that they do is that every single term, 
there are new books and new topics to read and study. And that really makes it really exciting. Um, finishing something and starting something new feels like a great accomplishment. And sometimes, you know, our children may not find one topic all that interesting. Well, it's really hard when you have to stick with that topic for the rest of the year or go out and buy new curriculum because your student just doesn't like it. Where in this case, every 12 weeks, you are moving on to something new. I remember one year we did botany and my children really weren't that keen on it, but we trudged through and finished it up for the year. But this is where you are going to be learning entirely new topics and reading new books and read about new people every 12 weeks. So how the Alviary works is that you purchase an annual membership. The membership costs $2.99 and included in that membership is access to all the grades. You are not just purchasing one grade for one student and another grade for another student. It's a family membership and you have access to all the grades, which is a wonderful thing because sometimes we have advanced students. And in that, they might be advanced in one subject, but not in another. So in one subject, you might stick with their actual age grade, but in other subjects, you could really pick and choose from any of the grades, maybe topic-based. Maybe you want to find something that your student will really be interested in um, and things like that. You have the flexibility to really pick and choose throughout all the grades, what you want them to, what they want to learn and what you might want them to learn. And the excellent thing is that all the books from grades one up to grade 12 are high quality books. They're living books. They're written with rich language. So you're not reading to say, just say for example, that your grade 12 student wants to learn something that the grade one student is learning about. Well, some of those books are written in excellent rich language and they would get value out of it. They aren't childish baby books. They are all equally well-written, excellent books. The Alviary also organizes their uh, lesson plans and subjects in a way that you can easily combine your children to do family subjects. They'll even indicate which grades and which subjects are better for combining than others because obviously in a family of six or more or four even or maybe even two, you may not want to have to go through and sit with each student doing all separate subjects. Combining is absolutely perfectly okay and they make it easy by showing which ones would best be combined and which grades would combine well together. And you really can do it, you can pick and choose any way you really like. It's very easy to do. So while the Alviary does include all of the subjects and lesson plans, the cost of the books is separate but they really put a lot of thought and care into their book selection. Cost is definitely a factor. Several of the books that they choose are free, available free online through PDF files or they'll link websites where you can download the books for free or they're books that are available at the public library. And even the books that you do have to purchase, I find these books, you know, they're really more like, you know, novels, you know, those types of readers and things like that where they're not at all even a quarter of the expense of say many curriculum writers, textbooks and workbooks. They really are um, quite inexpensive. A lot of them can be found at several bookstores like Amazon online where you can get free shipping, but really the cost is much less. I've, I've bought science books that just one textbook alone was $120, where the science book that I bought for the grade eight students that I'm gonna be teaching um, this coming September was only $35. So there's a huge difference in cost of books compared to other curriculum writers because they are really taking from authors and books that have previously gone before us and written wonderful works. And many of the books are books that are shared between grades or used again in the future. And so they're books that you will use over and over again. So the Alviary is a Charlotte Mason based curriculum. But while it is that, they write their program, they design and develop their curriculum so that anyone could really begin it from day one, not know much or anything at all about Charlotte Mason and could easily follow these lesson plans. But they also offer a ton of resources to help you in your Charlotte Mason journey, to help you understand their philosophies and methods in how they plan and put together the programs. Because 
even though you could do it without knowing any of those philosoph philosophies and methods, it is helpful to know them. It's helpful even in your own, um, your own reading as a mother or a father to develop your own um, academic and uh, self-education life. So it kind of gives you the purpose behind. It really gives you um, confidence in the program and helps you move forward. But they write it in a way where it's unnecessary, but they provide so many resources to help you grow in your knowledge of Charlotte Mason's philosophies and methods. So here are some of the things that they offer and I have loved using them already. So they give you full access to their Alvieri community called The Hive and you can access it online through your laptop or a desktop, but they also have an app that you can access on your smartphone or other devices. And this community is a place that any homeschooling parent can start a chat group, start a question uh, subject and posts. And the other Alvieri fam families are very quick at responding and answering your questions or adding to a discussion. It may be that you just want to chat about a topic or you may have some questions about the curriculum. You can go there and talk about all those things. And the wonderful thing is, is that we are all uh, share in common this curriculum that everyone is very passionate about and are very ready and willing and seeking out to help others and help them solve their problems and answer their questions. Now you also have the benefit of posting on there questions that are directly for the Alvieri staff and they will answer your questions in post as well as every Wednesday they have something called office hours where when you um, post questions, they will answer your questions on Wednesdays through a Zoom meeting call that you can join. And in that meeting, you can also ask additional questions, but they may choose some of the really relevant or popular commonly asked questions that a lot of parents are asking about, and they will discuss those answers in these uh, Wednesday meetings. They're excellent, they're a wonderful resource, and they really are very helpful. I like to tune in because I may not, not have thought that I had a question, but they're able to help me deepen and further my understanding of the process and the curriculum and what I should or should not be doing. They also have a weekly newsletter that have tons of topics that they address, things that we may not have thought to ask, but things that are important for us to know. And it's, you, uh, you can see it in the, uh, the community as well as you get it sent to your email. So you can read through these things and they're just interesting topics and things about homeschooling in general or about Charlotte Mason or about the Alvieri. And finally, they also have a library of videos. So when you first sign up, they encourage you to follow and watch these videos to kind of give you the basics of Charlotte Mason and understand the curriculum, how it works, and the purpose behind all of the things that we do in a Charlotte Mason or Alvieri curriculum. But they're excellent. I really enjoyed these. They're not long. They're easy to get through, but they give you a really nice foundation before you even start uh, the journey with the Alvieri. So that's all I have for you. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope it's been um, informational and I hope that you give the Alvieri a chance. But in next videos, I'm gonna maybe go into a little more depth in other subjects with the Alvieri, like history and science and how they do things a little bit differently from other curriculum um, publications. I thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.